Hi kids! See what I have for you today. Help me open this up. And this is full of squishy, happy surprises. Wow! Look! Let's see, what is this? Oh, this is letter A. What do we have here? Oh, we have an alligator. A for alligator. Look how beautiful this alligator is. It goes all the way through the block and this is the alligator tail. So A is for alligator. Next, we have B. B, this is aquamarine color. And B is for bear. This is a papa bear. This is a baby bear. B is also for bees. And this is a beehive. Can you see these little baby bees here? Look how cute is that baby bear and the bee. All bees here. So B is for bees and bear. We have C. C is in the color orange. And what do we have with C? Oh, C is for cow. Look how cutely this cow is smiling. See, we have the cow on all sides. There's a cow here. There's a cow's tail here. So C is for cow. Next, we have D. D is also in the color orange. What is by D? What do we have here? Huh? D is for dolphin. Let's see. And D is also for drops. You see, water drops. This is a beautiful dolphin. So D is for dolphin and drops. Next, we have E. Oh, this is quite a big block. So E is in the color pink. And E is for elephant. See, we have a cute elephant right here. We have two baby elephants. One and two and they're playing. See, they're playing even more. So E is for elephant. Next, we have F. Look at the interesting shape of this aquamarine green block. F is for flies. F is also for a frog. Look how this frog is trying to catch the fly. See? And this frog <laughs> is trying to run away. So kids, F is for frog. Next we have G. G also has a very interesting shape. This block is in the color blue. So what is with G? G can be for grapes. G can also be for a goose. Goose is an animal that looks like a duck but is different. And here we have a goose and we have grapes. And here we have three baby geese. One is goose, more than one is geese. This. Oh! This is the sound it makes. This is H. And this is in the color orange. And what is with H? This is a hippopotamus. See how happy it is. It is smiling and it's laughing. H is for a hippopotamus. Hippopotamus are also called water horses because they can swim very fast inside and underwater. 
Next, we have I. I is in a light green color block. Interesting shape. It's shaped like a cylinder. So what is with I? Can we see here? Oh, look at that. I is for iguana. Iguana is a small reptile. So remember, this is how it looks like. It is smiling. I is for iguana. Now let's look at J. J is in the color orange. What is with J? Oh, J is for jaguar. Can you see this cute little jaguar here? Jaguar is a big cat that's found in the wild. And jaguars have a beautiful rose type black rose pattern on their fur. These are big cats. We cannot have them at home. This is their tail. So remember, J is for jaguar. Next, we have another interestingly shaped block. This is K. K is in a complete black block. What is with K? K is for koala. Look at that cute baby koala right here. And then we have more koalas. There are three of them. One, two, three koalas. And here is a sleeping koala. It's sleeping right under a eucalyptus tree. So remember, K is for koala. We have the next block in the same shape as K. This is L. L is in the color purple. But what is with L? Hmm, look at this. This is a lobster. Lobsters are found in seas. They have two big pinchers and they are very, very beautiful to look at. So L is for lobster. Next, we have a big block. Look at this. It's in the shape of a pillar and the color is green. So what is with M? Can you see this? Yes, M is for mice. One is a mouse. More than one is mice. Look at this. M is for mouse or mice. Now we have N. And what is with N? Okay, N is for a nest. Can you see a nest and eggs here? Look at this. This is a nest. N stands for a nest. After N, we have O. This is an aquamarine blue color. O is for owl. Look at that cute little owl there. And here's a big owl. Then these are two little owls. And this is the face of an owl. O is for owl. Next we have P. P is in the color red. But what is with P? P is for penguin. Penguins are animals that are found in snow. These are birds. They cannot fly, but they can swim very, very fast. P is for a penguin. Next, we have Q. Q is also in the color red. But what is with Q? Do we see this bird? Yes, this bird is called the quail. Q-U-A-I-L. Quail. Q is for quail. 
we have a big block for R. R is in the color plum. This color is a little different from the purple color, which is this one. We'll come to it. Right now, we are looking at R and R is for rabbit. Look at these rabbits that are running free. Look at these two baby rabbits. And three more cute rabbits right here. So R is for a rabbit. Next, we have S. S is in a beautiful pink color. What is with S? Can you guess what this is? This is a swan. Swan is a bird that swims in water. This is a baby swan. And these are two swans. Swans are very peaceful birds that keep swimming in the water. They're not to be confused with ducks. So S is for swan. Now we're at T. T is also in the color plum, like we had in the letter R. So what is with T? T is for a turtle. Look at this turtle right here. There's a turtle right here. There, that's the head. These two are the fins. This is the shell. This is the full turtle. Look, the close-up of a turtle right here. So T is for a turtle. Now we have U. Look at this interestingly shaped block. This is in shape of a triangle. And the color is purple. So what is with U? U is for a unicorn. Next we have V. But what is with V? Huh, do we recognize what this is? This is a bird and it's called a vulture. It's a large bird and they fly in the sky and they're known as vultures. They are very, very important to our nature. So remember, V is for a vulture. We have a big block here. Look at this. This is the color salmon pink. And the letter is W. And what is with W? Let's find out. Ooh, what is this? I think that is a whale. Look at that baby whale right here. So remember, W is for whale. Next, we have the letter X. This is in the color yellow. And what do we have with X? Pretty difficult, but we will find out. So this does look like a fish. But why is an X with the fish? Well, because the name of these fish is X-ray tetras. These are very pretty fish. They're little, they're very colorful, and their name is X-ray tetra. Remember, that is with the letter X. Next, we have Y. See, this piece rolls. Uh-oh, come back. Okay, so this is Y, and this is in the color blue. So what is with Y? Y is for yak. Yak is spelled as Y-A-K. Yaks are little bigger than buffaloes and they are found in the Himalayan mountains. Look at that. So remember, this is a yak head and Y is for yak. And last we have Z. Z is in a light beige color. And what is with Z? Correct. Z is for zebra. 
Zebra is an animal that's found in the African savannas. Look here. They look like a horse, but they have white and black stripes on them. These are two zebras right here. And there's a head of a zebra. So remember, Z is for zebra. I have brought all the blocks back so that you guys can have a look at these. These were our colorful A to Z and I really hope that you enjoyed this video and learned from it. And I will see you very soon. Bye-bye.